One thing we have learned from all our years on the back roads, farming gets in a person's blood. It's not a job, it's a way of life. Farmers just can't help it. They have to do what they do, and they'll do it as long as they can. Farming is in my blood. Uh, it may come to a point to where somebody else decides it for me, but at this point, we're here for the long haul. After 15 years of growing cotton and sorghum, James and Patty Simpson saw the handwriting on the wall. Something had to change or they would lose their land. The solution to their problem has amazed everyone. This is a maze that's cut out of a cornfield. It was something that originated about three years ago and I had seen it in a magazine. It was an answer to prayer. Uh, we were uh, struggling in farming. Uh, the economy had gotten uh, hard. We had lost money and uh, we were in a position where we needed to make some major decisions and uh, we wanted desperately to keep the farm and to keep farming. That's our first love and it's what my wife and I have grown up doing and uh, we wanted to stay here. And um, we're just thankful that this came along. How are y'all doing today? Good thing. Good. Good. We're glad y'all are here. Have y'all ever been here before? No. No. Okay. Well, the maze entrance is right over here. As you're, as you're walking through the corn, you're going to see signs that look like that corn right there. The pathway should take you through all the major Texas cities. Y'all find one you like? When James and Patty went looking for a way to keep the family farm in the family, they looked no further than the land itself. But rather than plant more crops, they mowed down some they already had. James and Patty built it, the whole state of Texas, from border to border and all cities in between. And the people came. I think we're lost already. <laughs> this field is actually 12 acres and uh, the design that we come up with, it originates with my wife and I, but we will send that to the maize company. They will take that design and um, work with it as far as making it fit uh, within the 12 acres. Which way is Austin around here? Austin is right back up that way. Man, are we lost? I think Lubbock's over there. Oh, all right, let's head that way. Now people drive to James and Patty's amazing maze from all over the state just to get lost on purpose. This is our first time here, and it's our family day. And what better fun than to come with my granddaughters. We are having so much fun, I really don't want to go home yet. <laughs> Probably the most comments that we hear is, is that we're lost. Another comment is, we've been here before. Um, Another comment is help, <laughs> uh, come, come help us. A lot of laughter, just a lot of laughter. 99% of the people that come out of here come out laughing, they come out happy. It can be hot, it can be muddy, and they're, they're still happy when, in my mind, I would think, why are these people coming through this? But yet for them, it, it's the experience of it and they, they love it. When the corn is ripe and the last visitor has found his way out of the cornfield, James harvests his crop and sells it for hog feed. Till then, you too are invited to get lost in a cornfield just outside shallow water, Texas. While you are there, you can gather gourds, pick and down a dog or two. What you're really doing, though, is becoming a part of the modern American farm scene where city folks and country folks meet in a kind of celebration of life on the farm. It's a life that means everything to people like James and Patty Simpson. Y'all ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. Unbelievable the amount of fun that they have out here with dirt and hay and corn. It's exciting to see kids that have never been out here or been on a farm before. The 
this, the evening and the sunset is our favorite time of the day. Uh, the temperatures have cooled down. The crowds come out uh, more late in the evening and um, we have a wonderful time. Uh, the maze lets us do things as a family. It, it's been great for our marriage. I really feel like this is our field of dreams. This is something that we would have never thought to do, but yet now that we're doing it, we realize this is what we're supposed to be doing. Thanks for hopping in and traveling with us. Now click the subscribe button for more videos like the one you just saw.